Hello friends, welcome to Ultra Pixels. If you like our channel, please don't forget to like, share, subscribe and press the bell icon for getting further notifications. Hi friends, this is a 32 inch caster LED TV. In this TV, the motherboard is damaged due to lightning. So, in previous video, we discussed about the latest new model combo board RU10.816A. So in this video, we are going to install this latest new combo board that is recently comes in the market. See friends, this is the software resolution changing code for HD setting input 05562 for full HD panels input 05561 in default the motherboard will be in non HD resolution this is the remote that comes with this new model combo board so let's disconnect all the sockets from the old faulty motherboard from this TV Now we removed our screws from this motherboard. Now let us install the new motherboard. See friends, comparing with the previous U11 or B56 universal combo board, this particular motherboard has small changes in the factory settings. So. We will do a detailed video regarding the factory settings in this motherboard. See friends in this TV, the maximum backlight output is up to 70 volt. In default, the panel VCC will be in 12 volt. Now we put all screws and connected the LVDA sockets, sensor wires, LED connector, speaker wires, everything to this new combo board. So friends, now we need to Plug in the TV and check the motherboard is working or not. 
So let's connect the AC cord to this new motherboard. See friends, now you can see the red light. Now the TV is in standby mode. So using this new remote, let us release the TV from the standby. See friends, now the backlight is on. Now backlight comes and the TV started working. Here you can see, this is the interface of the new combo board. Here you can see the mirror issue and a mapping problem. For that we need to enter into a service mode. The service mode code is input 208. While comparing with the traditional U11 and V56 universal combo board. In this motherboard the service mode is totally different. So today itself we will be posting a detailed video regarding the factory mode settings in this motherboard. So. Hope you like this video. See you in another video with another interesting topics. If you like our channel, please don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and press the bell icon for getting further notifications. The service mode settings video will be posting soon. So that's all for today. Hope you like this video. Thanks for watching.